Hello? Yo! Hey everybody. Uh, we're gonna be continuing with our Cyberpunk 2077 modded build. I sat here for... Um, I sat here for way too long trying to do a sponsored spot and I gave up, and I was just like, fuck it, I'm not going to do the sponsored spot, because I feel like, I read the, the, like, I'm not going to say who it was, but I read the, the copy for it, and was like, oh, they want me to do what? Nah, that's okay. <laughs> Thankfully, I didn't sign any contracts for it yet, so, I'll just pretend like it didn't happen. Exclamation point, donate in the chat. <laughs> How's everybody doing? Uh, I hope you guys liked the uh, cyberpunk video that put was uh, put up today. I uh, oh goodness, I literally get a text right as I start. All right, hold up. Oh, it's dishes, everybody. Yeah, so, um, I hope you liked the video today. Love your videos. My first time watching your streams here. Hello, welcome. Welcome. Um, I hope you liked the video today. Uh, it was a lot of work to go through everything, um, on the Nexus and on the Discords and stuff. There's a lot of, like, small communities. Yo, thanks for the five. We've been trying to reach you concerning your car's extended warranty. You should have received something in the mail about your car's extended <laughs> warranty. Say two to be removed and placed on our do not call list. Two! <laughs> That's hilarious. I, I, I haven't heard that copy pasta in a donation before. That's funny. So, hey everybody. Let's get started. Yeah, the, uh, the video took me ages to finish. Because I just kept, like, I kept checking up with the Nexus, making sure I was on a, I was aware of every major mod on the Nexus. Um, and making sure that my mod list had everything compatible, and deleting mods, testing mods, that kind of thing. So, I'm fairly happy with the version of the list that we settled on. Um, my build has some more stuff in it than what's currently on the list, because I am testing some recommendations like geoengineering and um geoengineering is the big one uh the finer rain mod i'm trying out uh trying out the arasaka arms mod trying out a few few different mods so uh you might notice some some differences between what i'm playing oh wait i just continued my old save file we're, we're playing the the stream file so, if you're just joining us, um, it was cool seeing you make a Cyberpunk 1.0 video because I've been playing through Day Zero build on PS4 too. I've only played up until the Clouds mission, though. This is not the file. So, I have a file going, um, right here. This is the last, uh, last thing we did on the live stream build. Uh, this is the big, uh, very hard modded save file that we've been playing. Uh, and we just fucked up the heist. Spoilers. And, um, yeah. We're about to do a, a really long scripted segment. Um, so... Yeah. Let's, uh... Sell off all our weaponry, because it's we're not going to get to keep it. Uh, will you put a message in the Discord CDPR chat when you update the mod list? Um, I... I won't, like, frequently, like, every time I make an update, no. Uh, because I... I've already updated it, like, six times today, right? One, I accidentally put an out-of-date version of a mod instead of the more up-to-date version of a mod, and so that caused, uh, an installation bug. Just, you know, um... Just normal bullshit like that. Alright, so we're heading into room 204, meeting up with uh, Dexter Deshaun. 
Uh, see if you can point out some of the mods that I have installed. One of the mods that I have installed that I really like is this, um, the E3 2018 uh, icons mod, and then the no buildings map mod, which I actually really like. It makes it a lot easier to, to, to just see things and pathways and stuff. It's kind of cool. Also, this, like, crickets. It's very relaxing. All right, let's do this. Now I'm not gonna tr I'm not gonna human room buff everything because you can come back to the no tell motel whenever you want. And there's different quests in the no tell motel, so no big deal. I have the Arasaka Arms mod installed. Uh, I don't know if you can tell with this suit on, but can I take the suit off right now? No, I've got cyber cyber I've got uh, custom cyber arms. Those look really good in first-person animations, damn. Let me in. He waiting. Doom sound effect. Doom door. WNS. N54. Even. Alright. Yay. Got it. Gotta leave night. Yep. I have that fast forward thing turned off. There's an extra mod. We leave the city limits behind. But first, your face got blood all over it. Why is it so dark? That's I have geo okay. I'm trying out geoengineering. Go get yourself cleaned up. I've got geoengineering installed. Like I said, I'm testing out other mods. We have an entire lighting overhaul and weather overhaul mod I'm testing out called Geoengineering. Also, yeah, I don't play with RTX. I'll show you my settings. Oh, actually, there's no reason to have it that high. Yeah. Yeah. And then we'll put that down a little bit. You ready to get fucking killed? Alright then. And remember, my character don't say shit. If he doesn't have to say something, he won't say it. Why no RTX? Because I'm streaming. And also, it, the, their RTX implementation of Cyberpunk yeah, is so remember fucking unoptimized. Seems I've chosen the quiet life after all. No blaze of glory for me. Your character's ugly? You don't say. And that's the beginning of the game. Our save file, we're five hours in, and I was rushing. That's the beginning. Den. All right, see ya. <laughs> Kidding. Tonight, I'm. I'm here to say goodbye to all of you. Talk. 
So that's what's behind that door. No need. Wait up. Don't do this. You could still change your mind. Get over here, man. Fuck this band. Not your crowd, not your noise. Do your own thing. Bastard. I'm gonna miss you something awful. See you in the next life, friend. Do you think Wapajack would work with Cyberpunk? I was thinking about that. I'll look into it. My arm. I decide who's late and who's not. Get in, before I change my mind. Silverhand. Hey, Shaden. Get us in the air. Here, put this on, and it stays on. All right, Go Rogue. Ahead. That's young Rogue, everybody. Rogue. Ladies and gentlemen, Rogue. We gonna meet her later. Well, V will, at least. See you, Carrie. You ain't gonna see me for another 50 years. Pierce are on fire. Pacifica scored off, shut down. APC's on the streets of Watson. Sons of bitches. Skull cracking out there. That us? Johnny's idea. Wayland's drawing Arasaka's attention away from the tower. So what actually well, technologically advances in the 50-year gap? I don't know. It's a good question. Chew it up, spit it out. Headed to Arasaka Tower. <laughs> Windows 31, exactly. Yeah, Windows 31. Take him out. Take him out. You can do it. Taking over. Fuck off, you corpo hack. Taste the blood of a free thinker, you milk ladies, you communist haters, you McDonald's, cheeseburger blood boys, you playboy jackin' no lackin' Son of a butt hole booty call. Murphy. Another access point. Get moving. Johnny. Remember the plan? Get the payload on you the sure elevator. Told Army. Them. Let gravity do its thing. Explosion Here we go. The foundation I love Johnny's gun. Screaming roll. I love Johnny's gun. I wish I could have it in the game. V should be able to have Johnny's gun. Shit, this character right here apparently is like, like a big character from Cyberpunk 2020. Although Johnny Silverhand was called Johnny Rocket Boy in Cyberpunk 2020. Jesus, Johnny, you've gone off the deep end. That's coming from a chair jock. All right, see ya. I wanted to see if there was something special. There wasn't. They let me do it, though. I appreciate that. You can get his gun. All right, let's go. All right, remember, I'm playing on very hard with all of the special balance mods installed, so the game is significantly harder. All right, bug count for the stream is number one. We have floating pistol here. We're at one bug so far. I love the Johnny's 
theme. They they do such a good job with it. Fuck you, Arasakas. Fuck you, hacks. What are the spoiler rules for the stream? Uh, I'm the one. I'm allowed to spoil. No one else is allowed to spoil. All right. What do you? What? What the? What did I? What was that? That's the melee attack with that gun. That's fucking sick. All right, let's see what's behind this door. Yeah, so that's the only hacking I do is I just like to check behind locked doors like that. Okay, save. What's behind here? Oh, shit. Like an actual elevator. All right. Bajito 2. Bomb's name was what? The Demolitron. We're good to blow. Shotgun Elite incoming. There, Run for it. Shoot the cable. Get the rotor spinning. We're on our way. That might just be Johnny's melee. It's sick though, isn't it? Not done yet. Still need to feed mm. this to their subnet. I fucking knew it. This was never about Arasaka. This was about your groupie output, wasn't it? Not yeah. like you could ever understand, Rook. You're on your own. I'm giving you four fucking minutes if you want to ride out of here. Door lock breached. Arasaka sons of bitches incoming. Let's do Love it. Expired. All world loves me. Yeah. That oh, it lights him up. Focus fire, goddammit! Oh wow, this falls apart. Fuck, that's right. It is wood. That's sick! Oh, yeah, okay, this is gonna be hard. Limbering up, limbering up, warming up, warming up. Let's take this watch off. This watch is just extra. That's just extra. Limbering up, limbering up. Love you, spider. All world loves me. That boy fell. Yeah, that's right, you got KIA. Damn straight. Number two. You see that? That was embarrassing. Man, I wouldn't want to be a cyberpunk developer right about now after that blunder. Oh, shoot. I honestly love that tripping thing. What tripping thing? I'm tripping in! I'm tripping over my own legs! I'm looking around in Saburo Arasaka's office. Fuck you, Go TV. Okay, so if I shoot the TVs, will it not show me the television broadcast? Because I just broke the televisions. Sweet icebreaker. Foreign, right? Just wonder if we know anyone who can switch the subnet protocol. Hilarious. You gonna help or not? Do spiders spin webs? It's time we caught some flies. Thanks, Mark. Now, just for good measure. Holy cyber cow. We're on TV. Take and a we look. We turn now to Arasaka Tower. It's evacuation ongoing after I an broke it. terrorist organization released a manifesto threatening violence. The terrorists stating that That's cool that it did that. Topple a monument to corporate colonialism. I'm okay with the audio working because I didn't shoot the speakers. But the screen's not working. I broke it. I'm cool with that. 
Going now to our reporter on the scene at Arasaka Tower. Hopefully he can shed some light on the situation as events unfold. Reno, you may be a fraud, but I'll forgive you if you pay for these new hard drives I want to buy. Up. Hit the roof quick. <laughs> All right, you ready to meet Mr. Smasher? Let's go. Oh, yeah. Can I... Does Johnny... Yeah, can I just... I'd rather not be forgiven. Yeah, you're right. If, if being forgiven costs as much as it seems like it costs. Yeah, I have a Johnny mod installed, but you're not going to be able to see it for a couple minutes. I wanted to do the Johnny Rocket Boy mod, but the hair is broken on it. All right, so question, how does Johnny escape Adam the first time? Murphy. Like, like, I want to see what the fuck happened. Run, Johnny, like the wind. Go. All right, so this is bugged out, by the way. I made it in time. This is a bug right now in 1.23. So what's that bug count up to? Four, three. Smasher. Told you, Johnny boy. Told you I'd end you someday. But he didn't. He didn't end him. Because he's pulled out of the building as it fucking explodes. Hi, mother, I'm alive. The entire, this entire scene from the version zero disc is on the second channel. It's very, it's so unfinished. Let us try once more. Your associates, who are they? How did you acquire fistful material? Remember, I don't say a goddamn thing. Which terrorist organization do you belong to? You see, I role play How someone. How did you acquire fissile material? What is he saying? Fizzle material? <sighs> the scene is fucking great, though. Holy shit. Fissile material. What is fissile material? Let's see. Vision material. Okay. Debating on buying the game, got the collector's edition game guide for seven dollars. Hey, you got a better price than I did. I got it for eleven. Hot damn. Done and gone. Fissile material is a material capable of sustaining nuclear My fission chain reactions. Died in that tower. Nukes. But there are fates worse than death. Soul killer, everybody. Do you think CDPR will redeem themselves? I think so. Uh, there's a chance, yes. I can't I sit here and say, of course they will. Die. But, yes, there's a chance. I love the voice actor for Saboro. Do, do, do you think there's a canon ending? Yes. I know there's a canon ending. What is that massive growth on his head? One right there. Is it spoiler to talk about why Johnny did what he did? No. You see, spoilers, but Witcher 4 can't happen. You would have to do something else. I've got a lot to say about the future of the Witcher series, yeah. Uh, 
I mean, there's going to be some stuff happening at, at the Witcher Con, so we'll see what ends up happening. And you, who are you? This segment is so fucking good. Oh my god, this set piece is so good. Yeah, this is the world that Valve wants. I mean, I want this stuff, but with less floating guns. <sighs> Is Gabe Newell Saboru our Sokka? That was fucking shocking the first time I saw that. I had no fucking clue that that would happen. What did CDPR mean by that? What do you mean? They established every major character in the prologue to kill off most of. Are you kidding? Jackie, Dex, and T-Bug. You hear me? I need your help. If you don't hit those QTEs, another thing happens. What the fuck? The point of the prologue is to establish Night City as this, like, place full of dreams and then rip those dreams away from you. You hear me? I need your help.
one? Did Cyberpunk look this good? Optimized settings, mods. Yeah. Knowing what you're doing. Yeah. Thanks for the gift sub, Kokai. This literally looks like the trailer, I'm not kidding. It's not the trailer, it's actually in game. I, I'm playing it. This whole thing is amazing. This, it, like, this whole section is fucking, from the... Beginning of the heist until the open world starting to out, really. Keep your eyes open. Fuck. We both could use medical attention. Do you know a Reaper Doc whom you can trust? We must get to Repadok quickly. Did well back there. Do not waste time. Victor will fix us up. We have to get there somehow. Call someone. Anyone. All right, all right. Greetings. My scanner indicates you are outside the service area. Just come pick me up. I need to get to Misty's Isodzerica. From a Vix. Of course. A vehicle is en route. We it love you, Delamain. Less than 20 minutes. We love you, Delamain. Cheers hey. to Delamain. Everybody cheers to Delamain. The personal link is damaged. Please proceed to insert the jack below the ear. Let's give some claps for Delamain. There should be auxiliary neuro sockets between his lymph nodes, beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit the vein by mistake, he will die. Indeed, as he will if you do nothing. I think I have the sockets. Now proceed to connect. Let's get him inside. I cannot hold it. I need to rest. That your blood? Misty! Cheers to Vic! We love Vic! Hell yeah! The yeah, FOV's tweaked, yep. Yeah. Not something I put into my mod list. It's neurogenic shock. He's dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. Because the way to get it to work is kind of finicky. There is risk of... I know what I'm doing. We've been live for 38 minutes. How is he? Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day.
V, you in there? Ah, my head. How you feeling? I don't know, Vic. Ears are ringing, and I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage, and I almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of hatred. Yeah, and I I've let it all out into a mic. Two more cyberpunk-related videos planned. Yep. I don't feel any better. And then, <laughs> promise not to laugh. They. It was too real. Do you think the DLC will continue the story? What? Or be more of a standalone story? Both. Misty? You're asking too much from an... <laughs> and then he died. And I thought I was gonna die. With him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here, got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest a You're All right. We're almost there. Open world time. I've played this opening like five, six times now. Now I know how to get the secret ending. Yeah. When I get to that point, I'll make sure to do the right things. Alright, see if you can spot some mods I have installed. Gotta get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way. You included. We got a Johnny Wick. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? Don't smoke. You work for start talking. Fuck. Fuck. The game works great on both a keyboard and mouse and controller, but driving's Fucking always shit. better with a with a controller. Rip the thing out myself. No wait.
See you never, asshole. Now like that, stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger. I can feel it. Our minds touching. I want a mod. I'm like mold on that fruit. changes that weak Creeping ass slap you. sound to a punch Nothing sound. I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Oh, fuck me. No, thank you. I'm taken. All right, and the heist quest is now over. RTX is not on, no. And just as a reminder, this is our boy. <laughs> Look at that boy. Is there a mod for working mirrors? What do you mean by that? Mirrors you don't have to use to see reflections? Um, no. Not, not yet, at least. Another bug. Have you looked at the websites? Not in depth. Did you go on the roller coaster ride? No. Not yet. Right now, you're only hanging in there as it is. You may recall that I saved your life. I needed you to return the favor. Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Dider, I am waiting. What an asshole. Ah, shit. Pass 
That's right. Mod list is on a video. It's not listed in an explanation in a command. That's a good idea, but I did not make a command. I will for the next stream. NCPD, open up. Barry, we know you're in there. We're here to help. Don't got no fucking warrant. Cut the bullshit. Just open up. We came here as colleagues. Nothing else. Haven't heard from you in a while. We're worried. No. Leave me alone. Congrats, Mendez. Way to be a prick. So oh, what? So I'm the bad guy? I'm not the one who's holed up playing the attention whore. He lost a friend. Can you blame him? He's not the first or the last. It's called life. Hey, what's going on? I live right upstairs. So keep on living. Stop minding other people's biz. Des, hold on. It's his neighbor. Is there anything I can do? Maybe. You know Barry at all? More or less. Struck up a convo once or twice. He's a friend from the precinct. Left the force not long ago. He broke down after his best friend died. We're worried he'll do something stupid. Relax, Patrol. Barry's got nerves of stupid. He's just a spiteful old bastard. Mendez, did you check on him when he's chilled down? Sure, why not? It's not like we're miles apart. Thanks. Just be patient. Cops falling in rough times can be touchy. Let's see what I can do. Hey, Barry, everything all right in there? Let's see what you got for sale there, bud. Cool. So I will mod my katana with that. Neato. No poo. It was a quality of life thing as to why they removed the vendors. You sure?
haven't seen you in a good one, two, few weeks. <laughs> Figured you'd skip town. Quitting Night City is not as easy as you think. Sort of like an abusive relationship, huh? What's Listen, Len's uh, law? I could use a little flow to the old pocket. Want to peek at some fresh gear? Sure. Let me see what you got. Oh, always poor. I guess while I'm here, I'll buy some pistol ammo. What ending do you get your last playthrough? Oof, the bad one. Arasaka. Getting backed up. Soul killer. Yuck. Alright, so let's go get my car. In your other game, did you do the 2013 Cyberpunk teaser Cyberpunk gig? The hell are you talking about? Am I aiming for a specific ending? Yeah. The good one. The one that everybody likes. I've purposely avoided looking at any of it. I don't recognize you. Just passing through. That's fair. It's all a shit storm anyway. I'd love to help. Did you know that all the beggars in the city were originally part of a much larger quest line? Spoilers allowed here? Uh, I'm allowed to spoil. No one else is allowed to spoil. Beep, beep, motherfucker! Johnny, did you see what happened? Something feels off here. You don't say. Don't mean the wreck. I mean the run. The city's most courteous chauffeur ups and drives away from the scene of an accident. Oh my, they really did some damage to my car. One of the best side quests in the game. Absolutely. Please accept our sincerest apologies regarding traffic incidents number 77111110196. The Delamain Corporation cordially invites you to its main headquarters in order to assess damages and arrange compensation. Uh, of course we're gonna go fucking do that immediately. Oh, if you're trying to point me in the direction of gigs and stuff, no, that's fine. Just don't tell me what they are. That's not spoiling. How much is the, uh... 
13,000. I've got enough. Let's go get it. Oh, is it in... It's in the parking garage? So it's a way for you to get another vehicle? That's kind of smart. It's just upstairs a bit, huh? New job? Get an upgrade. Alright, let's see if there's any junk around here that I can sell now that I just spent most of my money on a car. Okay, cool. So... To activate said quest, you have to waste like 5,000 credits in an expensive looking shop. I forgot where. Oh, okay. I've definitely not done this then. Alright, so let's go to the Delamain headquarters. Read the message from Mama Wells. Last honest cop in the city, clept meds. Your Delamain vehicle awaits. All right, let's, let's call her real quick. Jackie? This number is temporarily unavailable. Please leave a message. Jackie, I... Get the courage. This number is temporarily unavailable. Please leave a message. Jackie, I. <laughs> this is so stupid. Okay. Every time you beat a main quest, call Jackie back. Are you serious?
name's Dino. Deal with downtown, city center. V. Yeah, I know. Heard about you. Odd stuff. Need anything, you call me. Remember, Dino knows everybody. All right, Dino. crash on your ass. You hear me? He'll run you out of biz. Would you be so kind as to give me your lawyer's contact information? Fuck you, Cirque Brain! Thank you. Processing data now. Please wait. Uh, hey, Dell. Hello, sir or madam. How can I be of hey, service? Hey, you were dressed in night. What's got into you, Dell? Don't recognize me? You sent me a message saying I should come in about the accident. You are currently speaking to a Delamay network subroutine. Alas, my operational capabilities are limited. Could you please clearly recite your incident report? Don't give him any numbers. That's how they find you. Who? Corpse. Listen, I want to talk to Delamay. You are currently being assisted. Your identity has been confirmed based on a facial recognition scan. Mr. Hans Jonas, what phrase would best describe your experience of incident number 77111110? Did he just call me Mr. Hans? Actually a little heartbroken about my damaged ride, but I'd rather talk to the real Delamine if I can. V, my apologies if the receptionist was a bother. I'm preoccupied with the crisis that is ongoing, and I simply cannot oversee everything. I've taken the liberty of transferring a settlement to your account to compensate for the damage done. Ah, special treatment. Would you mind if we spoke elsewhere? Sure, let's talk. Then please follow the drone. That is one damaged drone. I'm fully aware customer service is less than satisfactory. Please follow the... Perhaps a guided tour will prove some form of compensation. This corridor links... ...to the office. And here is where the magic happens. The shop is fully automated. I'm pondering broadening my portfolio to include repair services. Alas, the shop is currently overwhelmed with work. Think I know why. I'm still looking into the cause of the death network. My working hypothesis is an advance. I must resolve the situation quickly. This sudden rise in incidents is proving costly, aside from drawing unwanted attention to the company. to have you here. Rather, surprisingly. Control rooms are for Ganics. What good is it to you? <clears throat> there was a time this facility was human-operated. I simply inherited their infrastructure. All these lights, what are they for? That's what I wish to discuss with you. A green light denotes a vehicle with which I am in contact. As you can see, that is no longer the case for some vehicles. Those are the red lights. Repair drones can't take care of this? This time, I fear, human intervention is required. I'm aware you offer a broad range of services and are unusually discreet. 
Thus, I'd like you to assist <sighs> me recovering my missing vehicles. Growing up loving Bethesda games and just general Eurojank like Gothic, this hits all the right notes for me. Why is discretion a concern? Unnoticed, unbothered, right? In my case, broadly tolerated. Yet a marked increase in inspections suggests the authorities have begun monitoring me. Talking NCPD or Netwatch? The latter. My legal status does not fit neatly within current regulations. If I'm not careful, I could easily be categorized as an illegal immigrant. Okay, sure. I'll go after you missing wheels. I'm pleased to hear it. I shall send you the coordinates of their last known locations. You must simply deactivate each. I'll then re-establish the link and return them to my garage. See what I can do. Delamain vehicles are exceptionally secure. Be sure to have a scanner with decryption capability on your person. It's far more like an immersive sim than a, than a RPG, correct. We were talking about... already. You sure got that ear to the ground. Siempre. Anyway, you need something. You know where to find me. It's right there? Am I near the Junichi store? I know I'm in downtown. Oh yeah. You can't get in though, can you? It's just an ad. not that one then well what's fun about all the Junichi locations is that they're actually fully modeled <laughs> never mind
And so another Junichi location. Dude, get out of the middle of the road. What are they freaking out about? Mm, bug. Alrighty. Look at all these completed quests. So I'm actually just gonna walk around. Like I'm not even gonna go after a specific quest right now. I'm just gonna just gonna kinda explore. Good day, v. For this reason. There is a man who must be justice. This is a personal matter. I'll pay extra. More info attached. I'm counting on you, V. Cyber Matrix. Okay, well, I, I can see that there's nothing rendered behind that door. Alright, so. Um, this is a gun for hire. Uh, at a dive bar on the corner of Congress and Pigeon. There's a time for forgiveness and a time for revenge. There's a time for turning the other cheek and a time for crushing your enemies like the roaches they are. In the words of the prophet Jeremiah, cursed is he who keeps the sword from bloodshed. You are the man. The man you are to eliminate is, Carbu is Karubo Baire. He's an old timer, but don't let appearances fool you. He used to be a solo. He killed my friends people who were like brothers and sisters to me. When the hell all broke loose in Night City, he fled to the East Coast. <clears throat> now he's back, probably thinking everyone forgot about him. But not me. Karubo runs a filthy dive that serves as a Valentino hangout. Go there and show him that nobody can avoid the hand of justice. And try not to make a scene, okay? Be professional. No unnecessary attention. Alright. Let's see what we can do. That is definitely a hostile location. So let's see if there's anything we can do. Use technical ability 16 out of 10. How hard is this one gonna be? Oh, very high. Very hard. Okay. So we're not gonna do that right now. This part of the city is hardest and highest level enemies. Alright, so what we're gonna do is find a fast travel point. Um... And we're gonna do some shit in Kabuki. Just walk for hours. You see, I would. Alright, let's see here. So fucking cool. Look how seamless that shit is. Hey, yo, Tyler, any tips for someone who just got fired from their job today? Everybody's hiring, man. You have worth and remember it. CPD subcons. Suspected organized crime activity reported at corner of Drake and Cartwright. Tiger Claw gang members suspected of armed robbery and extortion are at the scene. Leader is Mokomichi. 
This guy is immune to burning. However, he takes 50% of all grenade damage. Smart bullets miss 80% of the time. Immune to ultimate hacks. Ram cost plus two. Upload time plus one. All right, so for tiger claws, it looks like grenades are good. Okay. Yamada, AKA Motor Boy. City's put up a reward for the removal of Yamada and his accomplices from the area. Sounds good. Let's make sure I got some good grenades equipped. All right, let's save. And also while we're here, let's see if I can figure out how to use where what you want. All right, head. Select armor or weapons you want to modify. I just want to remove it. Is this not the mod that I think it is? Armor or weapon mods, remove mods, change. No, it's not what I. It's not what I wanted. It's fine. You focus on that runner build or more about skill building? Uh, right now, I'm way too early in the game to have any kind of uh, character building to a point where I think I'm building a certain class. Right now, because of all the um, balance mods I have installed, I'm kind of just like in the early levels focusing on pushing up my health, my athletics, you know? Um, and I'm trying to use handguns in melee because I used shotguns predominantly last time. However, net net running is definitely something I want to do um, the further I get in. So, uh, net running and stealth is always fun. Oh, and there's suspected crime activity going on behind me. All right, I'm gonna go around. So I'm focusing on this NCPD side hustle, which is not this one. Okay, that's fine. Bop, bop, bop. Oh, I've got, let's put a handgun trait. Reduces reload time, crit damage, let's do reload time. I do have ma manual reload installed. Okay, so this is an organized crime area. I can't do any sub hacks unless I. Hmm. Can I just walk right up? No, no. No, I can't. I have an idea. good in the beginning. Ooh, contagion. I'm poisoned. That's the better net runners for you. Cyberware malfunction. Oof. 
Man, this game is so much harder. But to be honest, that's good because man was this game easy. Alright, let's jack in so that I can actually hack these people. Let's get into their network. Alright, 1C, 1C, 5, 5, 5, 5. Alright, there. Now I'm into their network. Fun shit. Man, they're using contagion a lot. I love how you do their quest line and you find out their industry plants that are actually American. That's such a great touch. Alright, where is the Netrunner? Actually, now that I think about it, I can use hacks on these people now. Ooh, but I don't have enough RAM for this stuff. I have... Br I have... Si um... The only radio mod I have installed right now is a uh, really cool city pop, like, 1980s, 1970s funk, Japanese funk stuff, which I feel like really fits uh, the game. It's really, really good. Your Plastic Love type stuff. I don't think Plastic Love's actually in it, though. That's the Netrunner. Wait, no, it's not. Who's the Netrunner? Is it you? Oh, it's you. Yeah. Oof. Oh, it's tough. Just one NCPC Psy Hustle. Is that hard? These mods are awesome. I am playing on very hard difficulty. You're just hanging out, man. Good for you. You've got balls of steel. Oh, someone's alive. Late 70s, early 80s Japanese pop uh, is fucking awesome because it's all that city pop funk stuff. It's so fucking good. Oh my god. I know that that's kind of normy because all the YouTube recommendation stuff, but fuck it. It's so good. Something that I've noticed... I don't know if this is a bug or if it's intended. I'd be surprised if it's intended. But every environmental radio is tuned to Vexel Storm. Every single one. So when you mod and you have it set to Vexel Storm, you'll almost always hear your modded station. Alright, so this must be the the leader that I'm I was sent to kill I need double jump double jump is so great unless they've bugged themselves into an area that I can't actually get into hmm this might have happened Yeah, that's what happened. Oh, fuck your life. <laughs> okay. Uh, 
One of the videos that I'm working on, aside from the big alleged future of CD Projekt Red video, which is actually getting close, um, is my wish list for Cyberpunk, which covers all the major bugs that I run into that I want fixed now. Like, they're the, the big immersion breakers for me. Um, and then just features, quality of life features that the game desperately needs uh, for it to be considered a polished product, in my opinion. That's what I'm working on. Uh, I have good TF2 news. Which is good, you know. I know you guys like that. Can we get a sneak peek of your wish list? Nah. I'm saving it for the video. Wait, fried ants? Never gonna be polished at this point? That's not true. After Enhanced Edition and, um... The two or three or four expansion packs they end up releasing for the damn thing, mixed with the 20 plus, you know, the piece. cyber psycho attack on Night City Mayor Lucius Ryan. The crazed assailant attacked the mayor during a press conference, but fortunately was stopped by NCPD detectives. I love how that is a quest. Like, all of the news reports are usually related to quests. I love that. That's so cool. The story itself is problematic. The story is the best part of the game. I mean, obviously, that's subjective, but the story is the best part of the game. There's like 20-some pieces of free DLC. Let's do this. <laughs> Get fucked. Quick review right now of the game. Phenomenal stories, unfortunately marred by some technical problems. Uh, side quests and open world exploration is some of the most rewarding I've ever had. World design is great. Graphics are fantastic. Music is amazing. Sound design needs a once-over badly, and the systems are quite uh, hard to understand for newcomers. The, the, the game's design is quite obtuse to properly, like, enjoy the damn thing. Oh, the rush to fix yourself? Yeah. Well, okay, so I did some looking into that, and apparently there's this Reddit post I found that actually takes a look at the original Polish for the you have like two weeks left to live V line that Vic says that kind of puts that that's not what that's like a weird creative liberty that the English translation took it's you're gonna die one day within you know it could be tomorrow it could be a year from now we don't know the game was never designed to have that kind of rush it's a translation error it turns out which I find incredible how something like that could happen, but... But yeah, the rushing, like how the game wants you to rush, uh, is a product, at least partially, of its localization. Because that's not how it was meant to be in the original Polish. <sighs> Because you have to remember, quests are originally written in Polish, and then English translations start almost immediately. Baskin undercover. <clears throat> yeah, the HUD scheme, I love this one. It's blue, the uh, cyan and, and yellow. I even have the um, phone blue and yellow as well, which is actually kind of hard to achieve different mods on top of each other. Oh, coach. Fred. 
see how it is. Still jam with the band now and then? No time, kid. But I'll get back to it. The fucking days, those were. You know, I went to one of your gigs once. Ah, groupie. What, you have a good time? Honestly? You seem better. I also remember you vomiting all over the front row. Glory old bandits will be back, Joe. Just got some biz to hammer out first. Your band name is Glory Hole Bandits? All right, Dino. I'm in the mood to party. Where do I go for a good time? I hear Kerry Uridine setting up a real preem shindig. I'll get you in. Just give me a little time. Kerry likes me. So, Dino, what's good downtown? Shit. Place is burning up, Joe. What kind of fire? Since that soccer bitch showed up, all them suits are shitting themselves like they ate day old caliente. Biz fucking booming. Everybody's gotta have a piece of old Uncle Dino. You knew Johnny Silverhand? <laughs> Come on. Some little young Got a that. Delta. Later. Did hit one of his gigs. Uh, 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 I didn't think these fuckers were actually gonna hit me. I need to incorporate dodging more often. See, like that. Got him. All right, call Dino back. What the hell is that? Call him back. Right, so then what? Decent gig? Yeah, played normal. But Johnny apparently had some soccer suit tied up backstage. Said if they didn't get at least three encores, he'd bash the poor bastard's faceplate in. Johnny had style, kid. Got a Delta. Delta. Is that how you say it, Dino? Got a Delta? Delta? Oh. We got something in progress. Yo, what up? Jesus, this guy is strong! Oh, this guy's gonna kill me. Yeah. Wow! I gotta level up. I should have scanned the guy before I went in for him to see what his weakness was. How far back is it? Oh, wow, that's far. That's far back. That's far. Okay. Point 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 Yo. Remember how this game was supposed to yeah, have CPO? multiplayer? Yep. Doubt that's happening anytime soon. Wait for the video, doofus.
Oh, footstep sounds aren't playing now. That's a bug. How's the multiplayer gonna work, GTA Online style? That was one of the uh, ideas. There have been multiple uh, prototypes tossed around for CPO. More than just what you would like expect firsthand. Kind of When is the video talking about it coming out when it's done? It's getting closer though. I've been working on it for about a month now. It's 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 turning into something good. Ah poop. Dude, I'm not holding it to you. Calm down. All right, let's let's eat. Ooh, that's expensive. I don't understand why anybody would drink in this game. That sound engine's bugging out. Uh, I'm gonna eat your spleen! No, not my spleen! One of these, please. Enjoy. Calling all NCPD subcons. Suspected organized crime activity observed in the region of Goldsmith Street. Scavenger presence reported, led by one Barry Alkin, wanted on charges of first degree murder and illegal trade in cyberware. NC authorities offering payment for neutralizing Alkin and his accomplices. Dope. Sounds good. Alright, well that job's done. Let's take another job. Collect your reward from Wakako. Alright. Let's go see what Wakako's got for me. We're gonna walk there, though. In case we get any side gigs. Nice ringtone, thank you. Crafting is pointless. Upgrades is needed. Oh, uh, I hate that. Fix it. So immersion breaking. Drive around the fucking thing. My god. Is leveling up your gear gear still unavailable for keeping an outfit you like? Correct. Uh, there are mods for it. Um, I did not install the correct mod. Tengu. What's this Tengu location? Hello? Okay, that's Tengu. Oh, Pierogi World. The Brooklyn Barista. 
All these cool locations I wish were in the game. You level up your athletics by uh, getting your stamina down to zero. And then letting it level back up. What kind of DLC would you be interested in them adding? Uh, well, the only way you could really sell people on coming back to the game is if you did, like, three Blood and Wines. And then release it all as, like, one big thing, you know. And it might end up happening that way. Again, wait for the video. No way DLC will be free. The expansions won't be free, no. But there's going to be a lot of free DLC. Like, a lot of free DLC. Oh, the free stuff is definitely coming out before the paid stuff, yeah. Yes. We probably have a couple more major updates before that too as well. Like 1.3, 1.4. Oh yeah, them staying silent is exactly what they need to do. And everybody that's a Valve fan knows exactly why they're doing it. The difference is there's legitimate, like, reason for them to, you know, not stay silent forever. They're just staying silent while they work. As to not overpromise like they were. in a no man's sky exactly yeah there's a lot coming in the future for cyberpunk were there layoffs no some people had left but no Oh, we're crossing the bridge. <laughs> Man, this game looks so good. Do you think it'll get to the point where it was showed off at E3? It's been a long time. Uh, no. Kakuakata. Lady of Westbrook is. It depends what you mean by that. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well. You and that friend of yours. Until then.
You, uh, got any real meat back there? You mean, uh, from animals? Don't be ridiculous. What you got to eat? We'll talk. See for yourself. your imagination why do you think I came here so I wouldn't have to yeah I can see that <clears throat> you chosen something got something that'll keep you hard How can I be a power no no I am just fine thanks well well who do I spy but V in my humble parlor, no less. Wukako, long time no see. So what brings you here? We have some outstanding biz to sell. Remember Sandra Dorset? I don't forget such things, V. Here is your reward. It comes with a fairly ample bonus. Go see a Ripper Dock. They'll weave you a dermo imprint that will enable smart gun compatibility. A tiger class specialty. Yeah, here's something. I'd like to play pachinko. I'd like to play pachinko. I know that's stupid. I'd like to play pachinko. How much better is it with mods? It's night and day, dude. This is CDPR, not Konami. <laughs> you, you're right. Look, I'm not gonna argue with you. Got something that'll keep you hard for hours. You're a hologram. Yo, yo, ever try rainbow poppers? Purple haze? Got every color under the sun I do. Show me the range. Damn, we found a dealer. I'll take one of those. I'll take one of those. Take one of these. And I'll take one of these. She gets better drugs the further you get in the game. How do I get to that Ripper? I guess I have to go to that specific Ripper Dock that she's friends with. Hmm. <laughs> That's stupid. to look anything like that. That's fair. You wouldn't want your penis to be fluorescent green? Come on. Nah, you just don't like having fun. Is there a mod that adds punks to the game? Yes.
I was a bit underwhelmed by what the genital selection actually did in game. What did you think the genital selection was going to do? You have no idea who I am. You're right. Beta Citadel is a penis. Sounds about right. All NCPD subcons. APB out for suspect accused of organized crime activity near Ross Street and Shipyard Way. Scavengers led by Yelena Sidorova, presumed armed and dangerous, have assaulted multiple homeless persons. Night City officials are offering a reward for neutralizing the threat. Let's see what's good. Take your pick. Hey Tyler, just got home from work. You added the Nokia mod? It's on the list. Immune to bleeding, immune to burning, takes 50% headshot damage, takes 50% assault weapon damage.
Got him. The difficulty mods seem a bit too grindy. Uh, I think it's a good balance because it makes you have to try and use a whole bunch of different tactics to take on enemies instead of just weapons. But I'm far too early in the game to be able to properly have a handle on everything all at once. I mean, they're definitely nowhere near as, um... What's the word? Intuitive. But it's, uh... Significantly, uh... You know. It's just... How do I put it? Cyberpunk is super easy. Even on the hardest difficulty skill. So I'm playing with mods and choosing to, to fuck around with mods that, you know, change some stuff up, change the rules a bit, you know. It's, it, the only reason you think it's grindy is because I'm in the very beginning of the game. I'm level 8 with, you know, very few weapons that actually do much damage. And I'm just trying to get by with what I have until I can really start, you know, taking on stuff. It's, just, it's slow going in the beginning, but that's how it's supposed to be, in my opinion. You can't just rely on weapons. You need to be able to quick hack as much as possible. But because I'm so early on in the game, my quick hacks are super early. And they are, like, RAM costs for a lot of stuff is super duper high. So what I should have done while I got in here was hack this machine, which would then, you know, in, you know put in the network and the whole thing. So there's a lot of different moving pieces that uh, even I, who has been playing with these mods for a while, needs to take into consideration while playing, you know. But, um, you know... We'll see where my build ends up going. Um, yeah. I really like this game. So, I think that's enough for today. It was two hours plus. So let's make a, a hard save and we'll continue this tomorrow. Um, got some TF2 news I want to get out tomorrow. And, uh, yeah. Anywho, thanks for hanging out with me tonight. I uh, appreciate it. Thanks for watching my videos. Super appreciate it. Um, yeah, I'll talk to you all later. Peace and hair grease. Bye.